Hey guys, Ruben here and a 2 minute quick tip for you. Now, I'll talk about the difference between a line in and a mic in on your audio interface. So, a line in is basically for line level signals and uh, things like that are like CD players or even the tables which have a line out in them. So basically what you do is, if you want to record those things up, you line out from them into the line inputs of your audio interface. And the reason for that is because line level signals carries a much higher level of signal and it does not need any sort of amplification for it to work. Now we have a mic input on your audio interface and mic inputs are obviously for microphones. Now the problem with that is microphones carries a much lower level of signal and they need a preamp for it to work. And that's why there's preamps built into your audio interface and also standalone preamps out in the market. So let's say you have a standalone preamp um, that you bought, right? So the signal is going to look like this. You have a microphone coming into your preamp and your preamp basically amplifies the signal, right? And from your preamp, you line out into the line ins of your audio interface. And that's because your preamp has already amplified the signal. So you only have to line out the signal into your line ins of your audio interface. So I hope that helps. Now, there's one more that you should know. It's called the instrument um, inputs on your audio interface. Now, different instrument inputs are pretty much very simple. Instrument inputs are for instruments and things like guitar. So you have a guitar or bass, you know, an electric, electric guitar or bass, and you basically line out into an instrument in on your audio interface. So I hope that helps and um, good luck.